In this presentation, I will discuss something called Wicked Tools. This is a description of how value will be created, stored, and exchanged in the game of social capitalism. So today, you wake up in the morning, you get in your car, and you go to work. You know what to do in order to uh, get paid. Then you take that money and you go to the store and you buy, say, a can of tuna fish. So you buy a can of tuna fish for a dollar. It's a very simple transaction. And the reason it's simple is because you don't have to go catch the tuna fish. And what's behind that transaction, however, is very complex. So we're going to emulate all the structures behind the financial markets and we're going to apply them to social capital markets. Okay, so in order to do that, we have to understand what is being produced, who's doing the production, and how to generate value from a social capitalist system. Okay, so the WICKED stands for Wisdom, Innovation, Knowledge, Information, and Data. These are the building blocks for the storage and the exchange of value in social capitalism. The term tools refers to a simple algorithm for how the value will be created. And it'll be created from transforming from one wicked element to another. So in other words, transforming data into information creates value. Transforming information into knowledge creates value. Transforming knowledge into innovation creates value, and transforming innovation into wisdom creates value. This is how people will create value, by performing these tasks. That is how the invisible hand of social capitalism will work. Now, using the analogy to market capitalism, when we talk about the production of anything, it always starts with the harvesting of natural resources, such as coal, wood, sunlight, or the mining of elements, such as iron, titanium, and aluminum. So while big blocks of aluminum store value, it is the transformation from one type of block to a more useful type of block that creates new value. And entrepreneurs are the people who combine these things and transform these things from the lower level of value to the higher level of value. That's what entrepreneurs do, and that's where they generate their profits. So eventually an airplane is created from this block of aluminum and that airplane transforms a person who was sitting in Phoenix into a person who is now sitting in Chicago in exchange for money. So when we look at the building blocks of what is called this intangible economy, again, their wisdom, innovation, knowledge, information, and data, Social entrepreneurs need some way to identify these elements as they exist in communities of people so that they can transform these elements in, in this value chain to create value. Now that value can then be represented by a social currency. That social currency should be fully convertible with any currency. So some currencies in this world represent gold. Other currencies represent a basket of scarce commodities. Yet other currencies represent debt. That's the promise of future productivity. Well, social currency will represent the social value inherent in communities of people. Now, keep in mind that innovation is a promise backed by future productivity. This means that the currency backed by innovation is readily convertible with the currency backed by debt. That's the secret weapon of social capitalism.